MC Lumbering, and I just got this Lanyard Switchblade, and this is the review. I've had it for about three weeks, and I'll tell you some specs about it. Um, it's about 40.5 inches long and about 10 inches wide. It has the wheelbase of 31.5 inches, and it has little or no flex, um, but you can kind of feel it, but not a lot. It's mainly for... Um, hey man. <laughs> it's for more of free ride than downhill, but there's a lot of downhill you can do on this because the feet, you can lock in your feet, and it's good for sliding too. It has a W concave, which you can maybe see right here. Can you see it? I don't know. But you can tell when you're riding it that it has a W concave. I have mine drop through right now. But you can top mount it, but I prefer drop through. Um, the design on the bottom of the board, it's pretty cool. It's the background's blue, and then it has an octopus holding a crown or something, and then a spade or crown or something. Um, the durability on this board is okay because it's made out of maple, maple plywoods, like nine layers of ply, uh, maple plywood, but the first day I got it, I was riding on a hill, and the tip hit a curb right there, if you can see that, it's pretty bad, so it's put together not that well, but um, the grip tape, when I do toe sides, it's it's been coming off a little bit, but I'll sh this is really my review on this board and I'll show you some videos of the board of me riding it after I'm done. I'm Alec from Sealer Longboarding and this is the Lanyards Switchblade. See you guys.